Thank you, sir. Second down. Edwards. Inside the five. Third down and goal. Edwards again. It's 20, Notre Dame, 14, Ohio State. Spectacular night to be flying the Cleveland, the Buffalo Bills, and the Cleveland Browns. The ABC's NFL Monday Night Football, and this is Terry Glenn. And tripped up. George trying to get behind him. Eight and a half minutes to go in the third quarter, 20 to 14. Irish lead. Ohio State's first possession. Down the middle, the man is wide open. Ricky Dudley, the tight end. It's first down after Ricky's catch at the 45 yard line. Movement all over the place. Oh, they back him up. It's second down, 11. Here's Hoying looking. He's got Glenn, and Glenn was open. Third and 11. They hurt themselves. They've had their chances and they haven't cashed them in. There's a ball thrown outside. Double coverage out there on uh, Nicky Sualua out of the backfield. And he isn't going anywhere. It happens a lot. Kick is away. I Bartholomew. Great for Ohio State. Huge opportunity here. 19 yard line of Notre Dame. First down. Give it to Eddie George. <laughs> yep, man. Sue up to the 14. Five. Third down and six. for the point. Good. So the Ohio State Buckeyes have gone to the lead 21 to 20. Shadows now, as you see, over most of the field. Lights are on. Malvin kicks off for the Buckeyes. Got it up. It's mostly at the nine. Hands it off. The ball is loose. And Notre Dame recovers it. From the 12. Paulus gets some pressure. Pulls it down. Throws it incomplete. Paulus looking around. Can't find anybody yet. Now throws it away. Ineligible man downfield for Notre Dame, so the penalty is against the Irish. Now the Buckeye players are saying to the crowd, you know, let him play. It's third and ten. Paulus lets it go down the sidelines. Eric Mays is down there. An incredible catch by Derek Mays. There are two Buckeyes over there. Just used his speed until he got to the ball. Kinder. 21-20, Ohio State leading with 3.45 to go in the third quarter. Action, Paulus is taken down behind the line of scrimmage by Luke Fickle. It's third and ten. Here they come. Paulus gets it away, and it's over the head of Mays, and intercepted by Sean Spring. The 11-yard line, first down for the Ohio State Buckeyes. Bobby Hoying sets them up. Eddie George is the deep man. He's got the ball. And he's up to the 17. What's going on there? I don't know. I have to watch it. Well, George has a look that time. And well, there's only one man, but he's doing a heck of a job. Doing a good job for one guy. <laughs> Keith. Pass is good to Terry Glenn. It's now a foot race. No way. He
turnovers, two touchdowns for the opposition. Josh Jackson. Good. Ricky Dudley, that big tight end, has played a very important part of what's happened here in the third quarter. Here's the kickoff. Mosley. At the two. Just by one. At the second one, got him. To turn around. That's not good. And they may lose this one. Ohio State gets it. So Kaczynski and Paulus can't come up with a snap. Eddie George is the deep man, Sualua the blocking back. George in the middle, inside the 10. There's Stanley wide up. They give it to George, and Eddie finds some daylight as Ron Paulus went to the sidelines at the end of the quarter. His center turned to him and said, what happened? Well, things blew up on the Irish. That's what happened. Back up. It's third down and one for Ohio State. One and a half. If you want the truth of it. More than one. This is Eddie George turning the corner. to play in the game and it's 35 20 Buckeye points in the third quarter. here's the kickoff by Malford going down to about the 13 yard line where it's taken by Audrey Denson Kaczynski the core the center is new the last three games but that exchange just should be automatic quickly to Mosley and this is not what Lou Holtz wanted to do exactly this is Kinder. Third down and two. Wallace hands Kinder. Picks up the first down and then some. It's first down for the Irish. They're trying to answer. After being blitzed there in the third quarter. Wallace on the option drops back to throw. And the intended receiver. Second down and ten with 13-10 to play in the ball game. has got his tight end wide open. And he's down. Rob Kelly says they've got it. Yeah, see, Howard is yeah. just a small defensive back. On the 13-yard line, here's Kinder on a sweep. Big hook. Kinder running like his shoe soles are on fire. Gets into the end zone at 12.55 to play in the ball game. They try to knock one of those defenders off of him. Didn't get there. Up this kickoff. Way back. Gary Glenn's going to stay there with it. And Ohio State will come out to the 20-yard line first. Eddie George and Matt <laughs> Calhoun. First you down. mean the bonfire last night. <laughs> yeah, from the 20-yard line. Eddie George finds a hole. Sean Wooden runs him down, but it's a big one for Eddie. I like this kid. George and Pepe Pearson's in it tailback as Eddie has to get a breath. Pearson coming around at stretch legs. And he's down to the 11. Second down and two. George back in. Great box gets. Eddie George.
Jackson right down the highway. The last 13 Ohio State plays have resulted in four touchdowns. That's how this game has turned around. And here is the key play that sets up this one. Eddie George for 61 yards. And that makes your score Ohio State 42, Notre Dame 26. 11 minutes and 24 seconds to play in the game. We'll kick it off. He's from Dublin, just down the road. Gets a lot of air under it, but he hooked it to the sidelines, and oh my goodness, Audrey Denson steps on the sidelines. Ohio State has scored in four straight possessions. And Notre Dame had just made another big mistake as Denson stepped out of bounds on the 11-yard line. 42-26. Dance is not over. That ball. Uh, the two-point conversion, they're only down oh, they're one touchdown. Ball. I mean, it's you know, plenty of time. This is Kendrick. It's third and six. Shotgun. He slips. He throws. Bad throw over the head. Really didn't have anybody available to him. Oh, they snap it up. Tough with Mark Edwards, the fullback. And Edwards dives for the marker. And I don't think he made it. He didn't. To make the mountain pretty high. Yeah, no, this this could put it away. Eddie George. And again, the offensive line. Ready to play, taking the crowd out of the game. This is George again, inside the 25. George again. He's got the first down. First down. At the 13. And it's Eddie George. And he is caught just about the line of scrimmage. Uh, Second down. Uh, Not much mystery about what they're going to do. They're... The road starts next week. At Penn State. Eddie George from the 18 will run down for. It'll be a 24 yarder. Plus 10, make it 34. And it's a very big three points. When he like. He got it. Now 45-26 Ohio State. Turnovers, turnovers. It's done him in. High kick. Very high. It's Mosley at the 12. Penn State's in trouble. <laughs> First down for the 26 out of the shotgun. Paulus. He throws for Mosley. They didn't accomplish uh, either of those uh, objectives. Paulus throws underneath for Edwards, the fullback, and he threw it short. That's true. Paulus bumped a little bit. Now has to get in gear. And we'll go down. Short of the first down. <laughs> I had the flu. Uh -huh. Ball spun off the side of the foot. Not a whole lot on it, but enough to get it down to the 34. Now the Buckeyes will try to kill the clock as George veers outside, runs for the marker. It's a little bit short. It's no fun. No, I haven't had it done, but I've had a lot of C6 come. Eddie George. And... There he goes, George. over huh? 200 yards. That's the fourth time in his career. John Cooper is very aware. Pepe Pearson is now at tailback. The roar was for George as Eddie came off, and Pearson now with those fresh legs will weave his way in there. I'm glad to see John Cooper doing well. This is Pearson again. And a couple of yards. And they have not played any patsies in those first four games. They were the ground game. Pearson being patient and getting something. That's the University of Washington. Didn't they have trouble? Yeah, they did. They only beat him by like 10 points. Pearson picks up a first down. Stanley Jackson comes in at quarterback, and Bob Hoying goes out, having thrown for four touchdowns. Taking their bows. And 
Inside one minute to go in the ball game now. And Jermon Jackson is the tailback. So this one's about done. Six.